Apple headquarters is here trying to inform the public so that they do not listen to rumors. One of the lies that was spreaded after the fighting on the night of Sunday was that Major General Marial Chen Wong, the commander of the Presidential Guard, was rumored to have been killed. This is a lie. General Marial is alive and he will appear in the TV uh, anytime from now uh, for his friends, his relatives, for the S members of the SPLA in general to be assured that he is alive. That is one. Secondly, we assure the public that the forces, the national security forces, including the SPLA and the police of South Sudan, have established a firm control of Juba town and life is returning to normal. We warn against all the thugs and the thieves that have exploited the situation to mistreat and loot properties of civilians. The SPLA is taking firm and tough measures to arrest whoever will be found to have violated the rights of civilians, whoever have been trying to deviate from the line of the army. The SPLA is a national army, is a non-partisan army. We don't belong to any group. We are a national army and we must behave nationally. We protect all the ethnicities, the territorial integrity of South Sudan, and anybody that violate the rules and regulation of the army will be arrested and taken to court. I repeat again, let each, whether you are an officer or a soldier, respect the constitution of the Republic of South Sudan and respect the laws and the rule of conduct of the army. Whoever will be found later on to have committed any crime, I repeat, will be arrested and will face the, the law. Juba is quiet. The SPLA and the other forces, security forces, are in charge of protecting all the foreigners, all the citizens of Juba, regardless of their tribes or ethnicities. There are thugs and hooligans that have taken taken the chance and trying to intimidate other people. This is completely against the laws and the army is doing its best to impose a strict discipline in Juba town. Thank you, Television South Sudan.